everybody and welcome back to my channel if you're new to my channel thank you so much for tuning in welcome and please do not leave without subscribing pressing that notification bell so that you get notified every time i upload a new video if you're not new to my channel thank you so much for coming back and i hope you all enjoy today's vlog today i'm not doing much it's gonna be the weekend today's friday the 21st of january um i didn't do anything this whole week so i did not vlog my whole week um starting today because i am going to be going out for late lunch slash dinner sushi with my bestie my favorite gunkum so so yeah that's why i'm doing this vlog i'm starting this vlog today and i'm making it a weekend vlog because tomorrow my brother's taking me out for lunch and then i think sunday i want to do something but i'm not particularly sure but yeah so i just finished cleaning um and i'm gonna make myself a smoothie for a quick breakfast and then i'm gonna make myself a bigger breakfast slash lunch later on um so let's make the smoothie i'm just making a berry smoothie using frozen berries from um from checkers with the water it's not much so i'll just take you along God. Hey guys, so I've just finished my smoothie and I'm where I was working. I'm gonna still continue working, but um, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you would know that I restarted my wig making and wig maintenance business that I had in varsity through to like 2019 um but had to close and stop rather because of covid and lockdown and everything and then 2021 was too much of a hectic year for me and like late 2020 was too much of a hectic um time for me i was going through a lot i was going through a breakup i was going through studying i was going through adjusting work in, in a pandemic a lot was happening so i couldn't really couldn't really continue my business so i didn't open it even last year but this year i decided to open it again so now i am shooting content for it and also because i want to show before and afters of my services basically and then i'm also gonna go to this shop around here to go collect some stuff that i got for my business and i'm gonna show you guys the haul for that and yeah so now i'm just gonna be um i'm cheating i'm restoring a wig i'm doing a restoration treatment um i'll put everything in the description box and link my business oh my word at this table and link my business page in the description box so that you guys can follow it if you guys are in the centurion protoria Gauteng, I mean, not Gauteng, Centurion, Pretoria, Johannesburg area. I do offer my services and I do do house calls. It's every, everything is on everything that I've posted on my page, and I will share that if you want your wigs done, if you want your wigs maintained, if you want your wigs treated. I'm your girl.
baby. Baby, I like your style. <laughs> yeah. Grips on your waist, run away back way. You know that I don't play. Streets unsafe, but I never run away. And so now I'm off to uh, Z Wigs. It's a shop to pick up my things. I'm gonna link the store in the in my description box so that you guys know what they sell but they basically sell things that you need for wigs weaves everything like tools like everything under the sun that you need for wigs even the like developers and coloring things that um, that you need to dye hair and stuff they sell that and they also I think they import things from the US as well because they have the hair colors that the people in US, YouTube, US YouTubers when they're dyeing their hair, the, the adore watercolor thing, they have that as well. So I'm going to pick up my stuff there, then I'm going to come back, I'm going to make myself something quick to eat, then I'm going to do my makeup, then I'm going to be off to fetch our favorite Gunkle tour in order for us to go out for sushi. So let's go y'all. Hey y'all, so I'm back. z Wigs SA. That's basically the handle on instagram you can check out what they have i bought myself a conditioning steaming down. this thing uh if you want to like deep condition it's a deep conditioning uh thing if you want to deep condition your, your wigs you definitely plug this in i saw something okay thank god but you plug you put your wig in here so it's like a cooler box but it's for deep conditioning your wigs and it heats so you put it on high or low you put it on over here and then it's gonna deep condition your wig for you so that's definitely something i'm gonna need especially considering the fact that i'm gonna be restoring people's wigs so i want to restore them yeah it's a wig care heating cap and this shows This shows how to use it. So considering that I'm going to be restoring people's wigs during restoration treatments, this is going to come in very, very handy. And now instead of doing my microwave trick, pop it in here. Okay, I'm not going to put it back in this plastic. Then I bought myself some elastic band. This is elastic band because when I do people's wigs, I like putting elastic for extra security. Then lastly, I bought myself curved needles because I need curved needles to do to do wigs. And I bought myself 12 piece T-pins. I've been needing these. I lost all of the ones that I had. And I bought myself an edges comb that has a rat tail feature so it has a rat tail feature there the edges comb and it's got a double edge thing it's a brush and a comb for edges so i'm also gonna be like installing wigs and so forth but i have not added that to my services as of yet because i still want to practice i not perfect at it and i'm not that great at installing people's wigs but i'm definitely gonna add it soon and obviously show you guys how it looks when i do add it luckily i've got a friend who allows me to experiment with her so yeah so that's what i got guys i'm gonna do my makeup now i'm gonna take you guys along for that i'm just gonna speed things up time lapse my makeup i'm gonna time lapse my makeup after time lapsing my makeup I'm gonna be on my way to fetch our favorite gun console.
me in my hands one more time before I go high powers taking a hold on me We say we were good together. I would say we had fun, but our trails would never run forever. Something else is on your mind, like everything that's good. Everybody say hi to our favorite Ganko Talk! Hi! Let the Ganko chat though! Welcome to my channel tour again! Again! We're back by popular fucking Demon! Turn I am not for Sydney! This girl introduced me to the bougie lifestyle! Ah! <laughs> Guys, so I just got home. Um, I couldn't vlog at Big Mouth because at the Nelson Mandela Square, uh, cameras weren't allowed. So this is good night for me. I'm watching Love Island, and I'm gonna make a wig. Um, but this is good night for me, guys. I will see you tomorrow when I go for lunch with Undando. Good morning, everyone. So today is Saturday. I'm gonna make myself a cup of matcha and then I'm gonna make myself breakfast then today I'm just gonna Netflix and chill but then I'm gonna go out for lunch with my brother Undando yeah so I'm gonna make myself breakfast then I'm gonna go shower then I'm gonna get ready for lunch with Undando and then we're gonna go for lunch and I'm gonna take you guys along for the ride so i hope you guys are enjoying this vlog comment down below and tell me how your weekend was what are you guys doing it's january i call Mali, so then i'm doing <laughs> also what are you guys watching because i'm out of shows to watch and i'm kind of over the shows that i was watching like i used to love the chicago trio I'm done with that. It's just boring me. Poor for Chicago Med, I didn't even touch last year because I'm bored. Chicago Fire, bored. Chicago PD, bored. What are you guys watching? I think I'm done with Grey's and Station 19 as well because I'm bored.
hey guys so today is sunday um i just finished cleaning my house um yesterday i didn't go anywhere i ended up netflix and chilling i was really having a lazy day and i had a wig that i had to finish so i did that i'll show you guys how that wig looked before and after um so i didn't go anywhere so today i'm going out with my brother uh we're not really going out for lunch anymore because i really feel like in yami so i told him let's go to centurion chesanyama so say centurion chesanyama uh we're gonna have some bright meats maybe a drink or two and then i'm gonna come back reset my sunday plan my week and rest obviously because next week is a work week and content week everything is just going to be it's going to be that vibe basically weekly i also wanted to show you guys that i bought myself a maybelline fit me foundation which in the shade 332 which is golden caramel i'm going to review this foundation today i bought this when i was in cape town and i thought i was going to do a video in cape town but i got sick and so i couldn't um i heard that they changed their formulation it feels so light i heard that they changed their formulation and it's no longer that old uh, fit me formula that old fit me formula i did not like at all because it always gave me a gray undertone and i looked very ashy and looked very weird don't know maybe it was color matching but i, I was matching my color right hopefully this one because i just spitball with this one hopefully the color the color matches but um it gave me like a very gray undertone uh, throughout the day like as i went on with my day my undertone was very gray and i looked very ghost like yeah that's my color char let's mix it there mm. yep that's definitely my tone mm -hmm. so i'm hoping to see that the change formula gives a better result and gives a better undertone throughout the day and it keeps me matte because it says it's matte and poreless and it's for normal to oily skin and it's got clay with clay and i've got very oily skin and it says um mattifies and refines pores matches natural tone and it has a natural and seamless finish so i'm going to test that out i'm going to show you guys when i'm done with my makeup how it looks i'm going to test it out and i'm going to tell you guys how i feel about it Long Island iced tea. Yeah. One thing about this place, they specialize in iced tea. How are my brother? How are you? This is You're in the vlog. Guys, you're the Bulala Club. What? I want to taste yours as well, okay? I mean, you don't need to taste mine. It's normal beer, bro. I don't like beer anyway, so I wasn't gonna taste it. Yo! Shit. It's a panda, bro. Nah, yeah. It's a panda, bro. It's a panda, bro. It's a panda, bro. It's a panda, Hey guys so this is my look and this is me coming back from wearing the fit me for about what's the time three and a half hours so it's not really a wear test but i was wearing a mask as well so not much moved and i'm just oily obviously in my t-zone otherwise everyone else looks fine 
um when it comes to the formulation i think i like this formula it didn't give me an odd undertone and it actually made me look good and it works with all my other products i just do have an issue with it shifting a little bit but it's really not so bad and i really enjoyed it on me and also as you can see it has lasted for this three hours obviously i'm not gonna wait longer because i just got home i'm gonna take off my makeup and obviously get ready for bed now but it's not bad i think i look cute i think it's a good i think it's a good foundation i would definitely recommend it because it is more on the affordable side especially when it comes to like drugstore makeup it's on the affordable side because i think it's 120 i think 120 to 140 depending on where you're buying it but it's really not bad it's really not bad and it really gels well with other products because i didn't use um, maybelline exclusively throughout my face um i mixed it with mixed it with other concealers obviously and other powders but in terms of your now if it me i think it's a good formula this one and i do like the fact that it is actually more to a natural instead of the full coverage um that it used to be i think it used to be full coverage but this is more of a natural skin finish i think i like it so if you are those no makeup makeup girls it will definitely gel well with you so i would recommend it otherwise guys this is the end of my vlog my weekend vlog i hope you guys enjoyed my video i hope you guys enjoy my channel thank you so much for tuning in please don't forget to comment what your favorite part of this vlog was and tell me anything that comes to mind when it comes to this vlog thank you so much for tuning in guys please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel until next time bye